Hi guys. Okay, a motto that Sam has had forever for all of us is, Mom, don't do more, do less. So every time we joke about doing something or trying to get something taken care of or do something like that, she always goes, Mom, do less. Well, this video is going to be the opposite of do less. So as you know, when you make a video for YouTube, it's gotta be horizontal. And when you make a, a video for IGTV, it needs to be uh, vertical. So I wanted to do this video for both, um, just so I can have it on YouTube, because I think it's a really, uh, a really good topic, and it is something that a lot of people have had questions on. But I also wanted to put it on my IGTV in case you don't have um, YouTube. So I am filming right now simultaneously on my phone and on my camera. One this way and one this way. So we'll see how it goes. So anyway, what we're going to talk about is the Palm Springs backpacks in the three sizes. I won't go into the little tiny one that I have because of course that is just eye candy and decoration. It doesn't hold anything. So anyway, um, I'm going to compare the three sizes, what I use them for, what I can fit in each one of them, and let you know what my thoughts are. Um, so I thought I would start with the little baby one first, and I will say right up front, every time I post a picture of any of my backpacks, the number one question I get is um, about the chains. All of my backpacks are the old model, so they are not the one where with the exposed zipper. I have not had any issues on mine, however, Kennedy um, has had two of the old backpacks um, replaced, and now finally has the new model backpack. So. Um, but she uses hers every day without question. Every day she uses it. So um, she had issues with the canvas. Now mine I don't use every day, so, so far so good. But the questions I get are on my chains and uh, each one of my chains are um, Louis Vuitton chains and they are called pochette extenders. Uh, for different ones. Uh, this came on a bag, I believe. I cannot remember what bag it came on because this one this one required a little bit longer of a chain. Um, but these two are pochette extenders and I got both of mine on Fashion File. And that one, I cannot remember where I got it. But anyway, you can always find them um, on the after, you know, the, the pre-loved market. So Anyway, let me show you what I put in each one of them. And I will say, because I, I have a chain on here because it makes it so much easier to open. So first, in the little tiny one and inside of each of my backpacks, I do have an organizer from Samorga. They do have um, ones for every size, so that is just absolutely awesome. And the only thing that I have to switch from bag to bag in case I use this um, as an everyday bag is my key fob. So let me put that puppy in there real quick. Um, so this one I would use, for instance, if we're going um, shopping or something like that. It comes with two of these black straps. Here's the other one. But I will say that most of the time I wear mine as a crossbody. Um, I find that the straps are too long to wear comfortably as a backpack because it slips off my shoulder. So I don't usually like to wear this particular size in a backpack. So I always have the extra strap right here. But on the inside, there's a little tiny organizer in there from Samorga, of course it's green. And in this one, I carry a card holder and I carry the little tiny clay for my little essentials that I don't really have a lot of essentials. And then um, my four key with my office keys and my four key holder with my key fob in there. I also have a little tiny pill case, you know, you know the drill, old lady pills. And if you're wearing it like to Disneyland or something, I do find that you can fit a beanie in there um, if it gets cold. So those are the things that I can fit in this one. So let me put them back. So my card case, fits in the little slot that's right there in the front and the little uh, clay and then my two key holders, my pills, and then also my beanie if you wanna do this in there, fits just fine. And actually there's even more room if you wanna fill it up. I don't fill my bags, you know, real, real full. And this little front pocket, yeah, that, doesn't hold anything. I used to put like a glasses cleaner in there. Do I have it in there? No, I don't. I used to carry one of these like, um, you know, for your my glasses 
in there. I can fit one of those right in there, but literally that's about it because it is not very comfortable to get stuff in and out of there. So there's the first one and um, I'll show you how they all look fitting afterwards. Then on the second one, this little front pocket does is big enough to be able to hold something. So I could put my my key carry my you know my four keys in there if I wanted to. Although I usually don't because I like to just have them. And if I do put one of them in, it would be my key fob one because it yeah because it's my car is keyless, so I just have to walk up to the car and I don't need to take it out. But in this one. Again, if you, um, this is the one that I usually carry um, at Disneyland or an amusement park or something like that. So I could put in a scarf and a beanie in this one in here with plenty of room. I have even put in like a really thin jacket inside of here that I can shove in there and then when it gets cold, you know, not a bigger jacket or a bigger sweater or anything like that, but that does fit. Again, I've got a Samorga organizer in there, if you can see that. And then in this one, I fit my, um, my compact zippy, uh, my uh, little mini pochette, um, the two key holders, my pills, and a sunglass case, which all fits in there extremely nicely and with room to spare. So um, let me put those things back in there like so in there so those are all in there snug as a bug in there and again you can use this front zipper and if i do it would be just for my for my key fob and then like i said you could put a scarf a really thin uh jacket a uh, beanie or anything like that you can't really put a baseball hat in there because it gets kind of squashed but that in there like so and it fits just perfect and I will say out of the three of them, this is the one that I use the most. I will use this like if I go to Disneyland or something like that. And then I will, um, if I don't want to change out my bag, I'll wear it to work and stuff like that. So this one is the one that I use the most. So then we come to the Papa Bear. So this is the Palm Springs MM, which is the largest size, which is, I don't know why they named them and didn't make this the GM, but this is the MM. This is the PM, and then this is the mini, okay? So this is the one that I use when I travel. If I fly somewhere, if we go on a road trip or anything like that, this guy is what I use along with like my regular luggage and stuff like that. This is a really large size. And in fact, um, Sam has this and uses it as her uh, diaper bag now. Um, so it's really, really handy. So when you open it up, this one has enough room for, you know, a beanie and actually a sweatshirt if you want. A bigger like sweater or sweatshirt is what I usually fit in here if it's not cold enough to wear it yet. And then again, I have another organizer in there. And this one when I travel, this is not my travel wallet. Um, I should have put that in here, but it's, it's quite bigger. Um, in fact, I can get it probably. Let me grab it real quick because this is the wallet that I would use if I were using um, this backpack to travel. So um, here is my travel wallet. So let me see. Let me put that in here instead. So, but yes, that puppy fits it. Okay. So there's my travel wallet. Oops. There's my travel wallet. There we go. My travel wallet in there. So um, this I use uh, when I travel all the time. It's quite bigger than my regular zippy wallet. This is my regular everyday zippy wallet and you can see the size difference. See that? It's huge. Um, but if I use this during the day, then I'll just use my regular zippy wallet. Uh, but for travel, like I said, I use that one. And then in that one, I use my, um, this one, I use my toiletry 15 so I can carry more essential shit. So, you know, more lotions and and i can just carry a bigger amount of my little tiny essentials that i use um my sunglass case and then of course my two keys again right here and then a glasses cleaner and all that stuff with loads and loads and loads of room to spare so um what 
hold on, let me put this stuff back in here. And my two things in here. And my sweatshirt in here. And my beanie in here. And yes, so they all serve a purpose in different capacities, which I think is just absolutely awesome. So again, um, I love these guys for the different things. So again, this is the guy that I use for travel. This is the guy that I use like to go to amusement parks and such like that. And then I can carry over into like every day. And this little guy is like for, you know, a shopping trip or something, you know, uh, daily. I mean, you can use this on the daily too. Um, you just have to, you know, carry less stuff with you. But you know me, it's either like really huge or useless but cute. So let me show you what these guys look like on. And you can go from there. So the, the mini, I usually wear um, crossbody like this because I think it's the most comfortable. And again, the straps are so long and it hangs really low. So I just find it kind of awkward for me. I um, know a lot of people that wear it backpack style and that is awesome. It's just for me, I like it better crossbody like this. And then the PM, uh, again, these straps are extremely comfortable, extremely comfortable. And this is where my PM hangs. The backpack itself is extremely easy to get into, you know, to take it off. You can hold it by the handle. That's why I like the chain because it opens up really easy. Um, and you can also wear it on one side. And the other thing too is you can hand carry it if you want, which I've done that too. So I really like this one and use this one um, the most. And then last but not least is the big papa and this. I will wear 95% of the time on my back like this. So when I'm traveling, um, it's hands-free. And then for my second piece of luggage, if I'm flying or um, if I'm driving, you know, and schlepping your stuff into the whatever, um, this is extremely, extremely comfortable and extremely handy as well. Also very easy to get into because of the chains and such. And the size is just really, really incredible. Um, I have had people ask me, you know, if I could only just pick one, um, which one would it be? And it would be the PM, um, hands down. However, um, the other two sizes are just uh, fabulous to have too for all the other, you know, um, things that you uh, might want to use them for. I mean, I know a lot of people, I mean, like Kennedy uses this every single day and she stuffs her chock full to the brim with stuff. So, um, I could probably also fit my compact zippy in here, um, but I, when I carry this, am just going minimal with this one. Uh, this one is the one, I could probably put my full-size wallet in this one as well, but I like the smaller one just so I have some extra room um, for, you know, a sweater or a scarf or a hat or, you know, or anything like that. And, um, and then this one, of course, you know, you can also fill this one up much fuller, especially if you're traveling, cause you only get the two things and, and all that kind of fun stuff, um, for traveling on a plane or on a road trip or anything like that. So I hope that this video was helpful to you. Um, you know, in size comparison, I am five, four, and um, these are the different sizes. And um, I just absolutely love these bags. I was just thrilled when Louis Vuitton came out with them. And when Clark said, why do you have to have all three? And I said, uh, cuz. Duh, honey. So anyway, if you have any questions, you can leave them down below. And um, if this is the YouTube video, please subscribe and hit that little notification bell and you can see when I put up some more videos. And if this is my IGTV, I just want you to guys, <laughs> want you guys to know that I love you very much and thanks for watching. And I hope you guys are all staying healthy and safe and I'll see you at my next video.